here is the uh, Make It Rain event. So it started already today. Uh, so we can go and check it out. This is where you're going to get your Kappa outfit. Zeppla and Realm Reborn Dungeons match Made in Hell. Well, maybe Dawn Trail Dungeons are going to be pretty hard based on what Yoshi P's been talking about. Oh, I bet it's in Thanalan, actually. <laughs> Usually the event quests in Thanalan. Oh! Of impish importance. I bet that's it. I bet that's it. The Kappa outfit. <clears throat> that eclectic attire, the distinct scent of the unknown. You, my good stranger, must be an adventurer. You found yourself in the company of Quivain, journalist for the Thavnarian Truth. A pleasure to make your acquaintance. Are you aware of the festivities? Yes, that's why I'm asking you about. I was drawn not to the promise of copious cactpots, but to the rumors of enigmatic water imps that have suddenly proliferated amongst the patrons. Oh, hey. We at Thavnarian Truth have been looking to expand our investigation. Uh huh, yep. Why have the imps made themselves known now? What do they intend to accomplish? Hmm. <clears throat> yes, let's find out about the imps. Excellent. Let's reconvene at Gold Sa Saucer's entrance square. Okay. What was this about? The event. Yeah. Make it rain event. Make it rain event. You've arrived. Notice anything out of the ordinary? Nope. It's just Materia. There's no one here. There's one guy. Wait, uh, wait a minute. It's Kappa. Man, he's got no ass, right? This outfit has no ass on it. Not that it should. <laughs> Squee hee hee. What did it just say to me? Some manner of greeting, I presume. Though its cries are convincing. That impish form appears to be not more than a well-crafted guise. Oh? And here I thought I could rival the editor-in-chief with my own unprecedented article. Now what am I to report? This is a child's play. Next to the extraterrestrial discoveries he has made. Yeah, well, there's no imps. It's just a guy in a costume. What are you gonna do now? This is unacceptable. Worthless. Fun fit for consumption. I grow drowsy thinking about writing such a thing. Fortunately, there's another curious lead that I wish to pursue. In doing so, we may frame our story around the current festivities, then recount the role of the imps within them. Okay. You see, as I awaited your arrival, I questioned the attendant to the imps' origin. Strangely enough, I was told that only a select few staff members were present in the planning stages of this affair. Okay. I was, however, informed that a staff member on the floor, a man attending to an imp, may have the information we seek. I mean, I turn people into imps all the time because I'm a white mage and you can do that in PvP. It's pretty great. Honestly, white mage PvP is fantastic. The, uh, Crystalline Conflict. And now you can use that everywhere, though. But Crystalline Conflict is super fun on white mage. Wait. Oh, there he is. Well met! My companion and I are delighted to make your acquaintance. He cannot speak like you and I. I assure you, he's oh so fond of making friends on this joyous, impish occasion. Well, he's just a weirdo. 
was the occasion of the March of the Imps. It is a fresh new take on our annual celebration at Gold's Hostel. It's left a positive impress. Oh my god. Okay. The costumed imps are free to frolic about the saucer and bring joy to those they meet with an adorable squee or kapapa. <laughs> Why imps, one might ask. I don't know. Okay. You don't even know why? Okay. If he should speak to you in the impish tongue, you needn't fret. He's unique, even among his brethren. What? You already talked to the... Oh, hey, it's Godbert, right? Whee. Kappa, kappa, pa. What is going on? What's, what has happened? Do you feel as if there's been some grave misunderstanding? The imposing imp suddenly entrusts you with a set of impish attire. Go forth, my stalwart apprentice. You have the sinking feeling that the imp will not provide you with the information you require until you've completed his task. Oh my god. You must wear the costume to progress. Oh my god! Well, I don't like this at all. No! <laughs> Oh my god. This is horrible. You have to stay in it, too. He forced you to stay in the outfit to do the quest. You have to stay in the whole time. But it doesn't even make any sense. It's kind of cute. <laughs> no. I don't want to be a kappa. I assume you work here. Yes, dude. I get off in a couple of hours. <laughs> Just imagining, like, <laughs> standing outside the gold saucer smoking a cigarette, holding this thing. And <laughs> <laughs> Tell me, which of these attractions aren't stacked against me? I've lost nearly all my MGP today. I need to find a way to earn it back. Wait, is that your way of consoling me? <laughs> As if I needed pity from an oversized frog. You think I'm oversized? Still, I appreciate the sentiment. The sentiment of Kappa? I, I mean, I could have told, that could have mean, that could mean eat, you know? Why do you assume that it means like, Oh, oh yeah, it's gonna be fine. Like, you... I would assume that they were saying to you. That's what I would think. If I'm like, man, I'm really down on my luck. Like, I, I keep losing all my money, and the workers like, <laughs> I would think, wow, okay. <laughs> you. Wow, you're one of the new mascots. You must know all the prizes here, right? I saved up lots of MVP, but I'm not sure what to explain. I save Kappa again. Uppies. <laughs> like. Uppies. <laughs> Aren't you cute? If only I could take you home with me. Oh, I know. They have little imps to look just like you at the prize counter. Now she wants uppies. <laughs> okay. Um Okay. Uh um, Wait a minute. Mr. Happy will be happy. Yeah, I bet that he is already 
change into his new full-time outfit. We need to go up. I did the tasks. Pa pa pa. Appears downcast, as if he were was expecting someone else. Remove your impish attire. What is going on? <clears throat> so far, uh, there's not much plot, right? In the ephemeral moments that the imposing imp's gaze meets yours, you are overcome with a mysterious sense of obligation. And realize what he's trying to tell you. Let us continue our discussion at Entrance Square. All right. <clears throat> yeah, now he'll be Mr. Cappy. Yeah, a bit. There you are, loath as I am to admit it. My search for the one behind this event has yielded little success. Regardless of my results, it's plain to see the imps are well loved by all, but I can't write an article on that fact alone. It's a pleasure as always to see with the saucer. He's acting like we didn't just talk. The Godbert Manderville? Never did I think I'd meet a member of the syndicate face to face. Surely you of all people must know who proposed the idea for this event. Your generous deeds this day have not gone unnoticed, so I believe an explanation is in order. It is I who proposed the idea for these festivities. Okay. Perhaps you were already aware, but we employ a void scent known as Typhon here at the Gold Saucer. Yes, he uses the funga for the any way the wind blows gate. It was not long after I hired Master Typhon that I became acquainted with a high-ranking member of the guild. Through him I learned of a curious spell from Angus Pass, known only as Imp. True to its name, the spell transforms the target into the very beings you have espied marching about the saucer. Master Ultros is proficient in the very same spell. Perhaps you fell victim to it during your encounter atop Dragon's Net. Yes. He oft refers to him, says his buddies and pals, in fact. I found myself quite enamored with these adorable creatures and sought to answer the questions that yet lingered in my mind. Where did the imps come from? And how did their spell fall into the hands of men? What? I poured through what few resources were available on the subject, yet I could not find a definitive answer. Heartbreaking though it was, I was left with no choice but to leave the creature's lineage shrouded in mystery. Nevertheless, I could not allow their history to fade into obscurity. When it came time to decide the theme for our annual festivities, I crafted the impish attire based on my findings and proposed a celebration in their honor. You utilize these costumes not only to entertain, but to educate others as well. But there's no... Okay. I feel a story coming on. Myth made manifest at the Gold Saucer. Thaumaturgical history reveals Imp's mystery. I'd work on the title, dude. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know if it's that good. Yeah, you work on that. This is the scoop I seek. But there's no imps. It's not that interesting. <laughs> that, we haven't met any real imps. It is as Master Manderville says. Much about these imps remains an enigma, but they brought countless smiles to the gold saucer. Readers shall doubtless want to learn of their existence, as well as the event that brought these new facts to the fore. Oh 
Oh my god. Oh ho ho, that's the spirit, lad. It would be an honor to see our imps grace your publications pages. All right. I mean, it sounds like just advertising for the casino, but... <laughs> this young man's story will doubtless bring all the more attention to the March of the Imps. Yes, that's what I'm saying. Give me the, just give me the MGP buff and the outfit. <laughs> that's why I'm here. Inspiration calls. I must away to make these ideas a reality. Okay. The article should be like, hidden in plain sight. Who is hiding the mystery of the imps? A job well done. The festivities shall be underway for some time. Okay. I mean, all right. That's such an, <laughs> such an appropriate emote. Like, all right, I mean, okay. This isn't life changing or anything. The outfit. That's why we're here. <laughs> that was pretty stupid. <laughs> Mission impossible. <laughs> Great achievement name. Do I really want? I really don't. I really don't want to put it on. I think I should put it in the armoire and never use it again. Okay, what else is here? That's it. I think that's the whole, that's all you get for the event. Yeah, this is the new quest for the Make It Rain event, which just came out today. So we just did it. As you can see, it didn't take very long to do. It's, it was fine. <laughs> I mean, the quest was really stupid, but it's a Kappa outfit, and it's a 50% buff to the MGP uh, gains. So it's a really good idea to go to Gold Saucer, do your uh, get the Jumbo Cackpot ticket, which I can't do on Sephiroth. I've got to go back to my world to get it. And do the uh, fashion report. Do the fashion report, too, for the big MGP gains today. If you... Because it's a good idea to start stockpiling MGP right now um, before Dawn Trail, because they're going to be adding new stuff. 